In this exercise, you learn how to keep your Elios drone steady. By completing this exercise, you can get a feel of the drone sensitivity and the necessary inputs required to keep the drone steady. This exercise is crucial because Elios does not have any means of localization, such as GPS. In other words, the drone can easily drift away. You need to master this exercise in line of sight before being able to do it in first person view. You need to ask yourself the following questions for the risk assessment. Is there anything that could enter the cage close to my objective? Can the drone get stuck somewhere? For this exercise, use only the two joysticks, the left joystick for altitude and yaw, and the right joystick to move the drone in the horizontal plane. Place the drone on the ground in front of you, then hold it lightly between your feet. Perform the arming sequence. To arm the drone, move the left joystick down and quickly slide it right, left, right. Before starting its motors, the drone emits its start signal for three seconds. Once the drone is upright, orientate the drone camera in the same direction as your body. You can now release the drone and take one step back. Fly the drone freely until it is over the square mark. Attempt to keep the drone steady, hovering over the square using only the right joystick. Once you manage to keep the drone steady over the square for one minute, fly it back and land it in front of you. To disarm the drone, move the two joysticks to the center and down. The camera is located on the front of the drone. Always keep your body and the camera facing the same direction. When the camera is facing you, the drone movements are inverted. To see which direction the drone is facing, you can check the two red and green navigation LEDs located on the bottom of the drone. When the drone and pilot are facing the same direction, the red light is on the left and the green one is on the right. During the exercise, if you notice that the drone rotates, turn your body to keep the same direction. The best technique to keep the drone steady is always to give small joystick inputs. You do not need to let the joystick come back to the initial position after each input. If you fly too close to the ground, you might feel additional turbulence. Try to stay about one meter above the ground. 